Hi friends and welcome back to Naturally Corporate. So as you can see, I am just prepping my hair for a wig that I'll be showcasing for you today. Nothing fancy, six cornrows going straight to the back. The company Fly Bayo sent this wig to me to review and I was more than happy to. The unit actually turns out to be really, really nice. It is a late in, an eight inch human hair, 13 by four frontal lace wig. And it's really nice. Nothing fancy about the cap construction, pretty basic. There are two combs on each, uh, one comb on each side, one in the back, and then the elastic band just to give you that extra security. And honestly, I have to tell you, I'm such a novice with wigs. I thought the band went in the back of my head around the nape area. It does not. <laughs> and I'm showing you the lace here. It's a medium brown color, which is a nice match to my skin tone. It's not perfect, but this medium brown lace is darker than lace I've had in the past. So when I saw it, I was actually very pleased and I knew that I wouldn't have to do a lot of manipulating to it or manipulating the color to get it to match. This wig is really nice. It's it's really good, you know, almost right out of the right out of the packaging. Once you cut the lace off, I did not do much manipulating to this wig at all by way of plucking the hairline or anything like that. So stay tuned. Okay, friends, at first glance, this wig is perfection. I have not put any any utensils on it. I haven't put a, flyer, a flat iron on it, a hot comb, nothing. This is the wig. All I've done was glued it or, you know, installed it and, and put it on, secured it down. And at first glance, it is perfection. Let me show you the back. I think it's just the cutest wig. And like I said, look, the length is perfect. It's an eight inch wig and I think it's perfect. I thought it was going to be too short, but this is ideal for me. Now I said at first glance, it's perfection, but look a little closer. Well, the front part is magnificent. <laughs> at least I think so. But I need to go back and uh, secure this side here. And I used some tissue and some alcohol to wipe off excess got to be glued spray. So there's some little, some little tissue residue there. But otherwise, this unit is amazing. I am so happy about it. I'm so happy about it. And I'm not even finished yet. So I will uh, complete the look and show you the final results and give you my final thoughts. This is the hair that I wanted y'all to see. Is this not the cutest eight inch bob that you've seen? Okay, y'all, can I just say, <laughs> There were a few factors that I swear tried to keep me from finishing this video, but nonetheless, here I am. You know, I just, I did not want to not share the second half of this video because I was this close to saying, forget it. 
you know, it's just too many little stumbling blocks in the way. I'll just post some pictures on Instagram or, you know, something like that. But I didn't want to do that. I wanted to show you this affordable human hair lace front bob wig. And then number two, I just didn't want to be defeated today. I refused to be defeated. And I put a lot of effort into the content that I share with you and psh, nothing was going to stop me. So if you are watching, you've made it this far, please give me a thumbs up. Please thumbs up this video and put a purple heart in the comments to let you know, to let me know that you understand how it is when just thing after thing after thing and not even big things, but just little bitty things one after another, just keep popping up those little stumbling blocks and they really try to dissuade you from accomplishing something. So give me a, give me a purple heart if you know exactly what I mean. All right, I had a few notes. I can't even find my little paper that I had right now, so I'll go from memory. And it's not hard what I want to talk about because this wig is so cute. It is, it's fun. It's, I don't know, flirty if you want it to be flirty. It's corporate, it's business, it's weekend, it's weekday. This wig is everything. At this point, I just have no, you know, no, no really bad things to say about it. So I will say this is a 13 by four uh, lace front human hair wig. It is eight inches long. And I was concerned that the length would be too short, but it's perfect because we're in the, the middle of summer and I sweat in my head and, you know, I didn't want a wig that would be hanging around my neck or I should say past my shoulders and I had a recent wig review which was the wig was beautiful but I knew that that was not a unit that I would be wearing during the summer because it's the same length as my own hair which is about mid-back length and I'm not even wearing my own hair down right now it's just too hot this wig is perfect I guess it's grazing my neck but it is cool, it's lightweight, and it looks realistic. And just as a reminder, this unit was actually sent to me by the company Fly Bell Wigs. However, as you can see, um, well, no, as you can hear, hopefully, everything that I'm telling you is coming from my own heart. <laughs> That's how I really feel about the unit. And I'm not a wig expert. I haven't done, this is about my fourth I think maybe fourth, maybe even fifth wig review on my channel. And so I'm a novice. I'm absolutely a novice. And I think this hairline is the best I've ever been able to show to you. And that may have something to do with the quality of the wig. All right. So a few pros about this wig. Number one, it is very cute. Um, this is exactly what... I'm looking for in a unit for summertime. It's not hot on my head. The wig cap is nice and cool. I feel like it's breathable. Now, at the same time, that could also just be because I don't have hair hanging all down my, my neck and on my shoulders. So it's not causing me, the hair is not causing heat to be trapped in all about, all about here. You know what I mean? So perhaps with it being a short unit, it's eight inches. Um, you know, air is just able to circulate around the back of my neck and around the sides and the front of my neck. So I'm just not feeling hot. Um, the wig did not tangle, did not shed, which I'm excited about because it's only eight inches long. So I would have been disappointed had there been shedding, but no tangling, no shedding. This wig straight out the box, no smell. I've received, uh, ordered and received wigs before and they have that that wig smell. This did not. That's why I didn't wash it. If you've watched my previous uh, wig videos for uh, human hair wigs, I shampooed and conditioned the wig first, mainly to get rid of the smell or to attempt to get rid of the smell. This wig didn't have it. And I figured, well, it looks clean. It has no smell. So I felt comfortable just using it straight out the box, which is what I did. This wig is, I would say, beginner friendly, absolutely beginner friendly. I am very much a wig novice. I will say it for quite a while, but all I did was cut the lace, put the wig on. I did, um, I did not pluck 
any hairlines. Just that's just not me. That's not my ministry, <laughs> as my middle sister says. But I did make a part here on the side, and I plucked some of the side part just to make it look more natural, right? Um, you know, I don't expect people to. I'm not trying to trick people to think this is my hair, but I want it to look as natural as possible. So I did make a side part and then uh, pluck it a little more and also add some of my powder foundation so that it would look more like my scalp. But guys, this is novice work. This is a novice, <laughs> the hairline of a novice wig wearer. The hair is super light. I did put a little bit of mousse on it just to kind of tame the hair to go in the direction that I wanted it to. I also made a middle part and I made another part on the right side so that I can kind of switch up back and forth. Um, you know, style it a little bit differently, but I bumped the ends with my flat iron and I'm good to go. And I'm so glad that I I'm able to show this unit to you if you are out there looking for something cute and affordable um, that's perfect for the summer just to, to have on hand when you don't want to deal with your hair i think it's just beyond adorable okay so friends lastly i want to talk about the price this unit is very affordable it is less than 50 dollars, and i think that is a bargain a steal and a deal for a human hair lace front wig that doesn't shangle ted uh tangle shed or have a smell to it um so it checks off a lot of boxes and you know my my goal is not to show you how to install a wig that's just not what i'm an expert on however i do want to present to you affordable realistic um just really pretty alternatives to wearing your natural hair if you're looking for an alternative and this wig is definitely a beautiful affordable alternative so again i'll leave all of the information on the unit um, in the description box and if you've made it this far don't forget to thumbs up this video leave a comment and leave me a purple heart to let me know that you enjoyed this unit and what i had to share as always thank you so much friends until next time keep it naturally corporate